Davido's uncle finally replied Davido. On top the message where Davido been sent to Ram yesterday, where he even tagged the uncle without fear and anything. Nigerians react on top of and guys, eh, a lot of people don't they choke mouth inside this matter. Even a lot of bloggers, like a lot of people, a lot of humble Nigerians, Davido's fan and all that. See waiting, Mr. Bamidele Adeleke, leave for Davido. In tell and talk, say, dear David, for whatsoever this is what to you, please note that I lost my mother at a tender age like you and would never allow anyone to denigrate her nor her memory. I will never write nor say anything against my auntie Veru, who I cherish dearly. You are the king of social media. You definitely know people. Take it upon themselves to write whatsoever they believe will give them clout. So many of your fans come to my SMS handle to threaten me. Some even said I should go and die. Did you send them to threaten my life? I seriously doubt it and I would not believe you would do such a thing. So irrespective of politics, please note that I am not that kind of a person. I have maintained decorum in the face of provocation and I will continue to do so. I respect your decision and choice of who you want to follow. And I respect your decision and choice to support Uncle Dem and Uncle Demola, and that is the beauty of democracy. It is possible we can all make our individual choice without record and bitterness. We can all follow different paths and still live as one big happy family. The people of Oshun greatly deserve the best. I will give the job to who they so seem fit may be the best man in Oshu 2022. You will always remain dear to me, Dele. And I earlier sent you this private message on your WhatsApp, but it remained undelivered. Hence, my resort to Twitter. <laughs> my correct and amazing people. This is not the message we Mr. Ademola, Davido Uncle leave for him on in twitter handle my people david can still reply in uncle can talk say because of your ambition you have your people write about me which i don't care but to include the death of my mother in an article same woman that raised you at adele adeleke okay now nah, dele god will reward you the truth had you that much you had to go that low to mention your auntie Vero that cared for you well i don't open my grace for the year at adeleke adeleke stay tuned worst of all this nigger really doing all this from the house my father gave you audacity disrespect i don't care but my father my mother never dele i will stress you we go meet for field dele mr fake intellectual you really dare to cross that line you did include my mom's death into your lies about me. My mom that fed you and literally clothed you. Sorry, ass. It's a shame. I promise to expose your ungrateful betraying ass to the world. To the whole Oshun state. Human beings. God. And guys, eh, do you guys notice that after um Davido and his uncle, Mr. Bamidele Adeleke, started this their um social media fight, his son, that is Davido's very close friend, whether they call B Red, has never said anything about this issue. You guys remember Ifani and um Davido attended B Red's baby's um birthday. That was last month, I think, that Davido went with Ifani to visit and he ordered his friends to make sure they spray his um cousin's son dollars that they should make sure that the boy in fact that they, they should spray bundles. I don't know if you guys remember that, but I posted that video earlier. But B Red has never come out to say anything or Sean Davido for insulting his father and all that. And um, this popular blogger on Instagram, which they call um, Uchima Dagu, aka Mr. Chris, don't come out to take attack Davido. Tell Davido Toxie 
why in good insult in uncle like that say yoruba boys are not meant for this kind of character way davido they display and all that according to uchi madagu he's called what davido is doing this being disrespectful that was what uchi madagu was trying to say according to uchi in talk say davido for just um show say in get home training making set to the matter for inside health according to his writer he said obi respect your your yoruba culture calling a 50 year old elder's name on social media shows lack of proper home training you fit set to your family while in private without being so disrespectful which mother gusti went ahead to write this is just so wrong oga how do you want Ifani and Ima Day to respect their elders when you are doing this to a 50-year-old man, old enough to be your father on social media? So no respect for this great Yoruba culture again, all because of Oshun 2022 governorship race. I beg, even if you know Sabi, what is called Agbalagba, what of your big cousin, gray hair? Your arrogance will not open your eyes to see that this wahala is exactly what the opposition party they wait to see. David, grow up. Can a house divided stand? This now waiting Uche Madago writes on top in social media handle about um David Doe. Say David Doe is being disrespectful to his uncle and it doesn't really make sense. Say there are other ways, according to Uche Madago. There are other ways to settle this issue on um, private no be said concurrent inside social media. And these are some of the comments where some humble Nigerians live for David Doe and his uncle. This one talks say, I was shocked he could do that. A Yoruba boy for that matter. Gosh. This one tell Uche Madagu, stay out of their family matter. Don't escalate the anything that happens. They are going to settle and remain as one family this other person talks say uche you are very right this person talks say obio will never give you that attention that you are looking for keep seeking for it this other person talks say anytime he wants to release music he go chase clout the last one na orphanage now na his uncle sometimes david the fuck up this other person talks say uche is it your family please mind your business and leave david and his uncle alone so my correct and amazing people this is now the update i see make i bring from ona how not take see this matter and how not to take see errors everything take they go do you guys think that the video is being disrespectful or do you think he's just saying the plain truth and the, all that what do you guys think please leave it for me in the comment section guys and i'll see you guys in my next video remain blessed and thank you so much for coming to watch in case you're seeing this video for the very first time please help me hit the red subscribe button and turn on to my channel and i'll see you guys later